everybody, welcome back. I'm gonna do a beloved and uber popular on YouTube, or at least in the beauty community, Sephora haul, yay! So, yeah, went a little crazy in New York, so let's just jump right into it. Let's start with the 500 point uh, perk that I got, it's the Urban Decay Essentials, and it's just kind of a travel little thing that comes with a setting spray, two setting sprays, some primer, and an eyeshadow. But first up, we have the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer SPF 20. This is the oil-free, I'm in Tawny. Um, this stuff is great, I use it when I don't have to wear foundation, or if I'm not wearing foundation and I just throw this on, I can still put some sort of powder over it, and it looks just as good as foundation, it has really great coverage. Next we have a moisturizer. I've been a big fan of Ren products, partly because it has half of my name in it. Um, but no, they are just really great um, products that are a responsible brand. They don't have paraffins, um, they don't use a lot of gunky chemicals, and they're not tested on animals, they're tested on people, which is how it should be. Uh, so this is the Vita Mineral Day Cream. So I just needed another day cream um, for the day. So this is a moisturizer formulated to leave skin optimally hydrated and looking beautiful, healthy, energized, and radiant. All right, so I'm a huge fan of dry shampoo. Uh, I rarely wash my hair, which sounds really disgusting, but I probably wash my hair, gosh, within a seven day span, I would say twice, maybe three times. but. In between washes, I really enjoy using dry shampoo. Now it's hard to find a good one for brunette hair because you get that white residue, it looks gray, it just is disgusting, and it's very chalky and drying to your hair. Um, and I like to use something more natural just because it's on your scalp. Um, so I am a really big uh, lover of the bamboo style. This is by Alterna, and it's called the Cleanse Extend, which is a translucent dry shampoo, and this is in the Sheer Blossom. I've had the regular scent one before, and it's great, but this one just has a cleaner, kind of fruitier smell, so. I try it out. So going back to my newly acquired, I guess revisited obsession with gel eyeliners, uh, I spoke about it again in my October favorites that I had to wear a gel eyeliner for this makeup for um, Halloween. I was Cleopatra um, and I used this L'Oreal gel eyeliner and it was awesome in black. Uh, but I've heard really great things about the Bobbi Brown gel eyeliner and its staying powers. And uh, I have here a Beauty Blender Cleanser. Uh, this is just the solid bar that you get on the little to-go bar at Sephora and really is great for traveling to clean your brushes on the go. The full size of the B6 Vitamin Infused Complexion Prep Spray. Um, it's a prep spray so it has B6 vitamins to kind of help prep your skin for makeup, keeps it hydrated and your makeup will last longer. So you spray that on clean skin and then you use another setting spray, uh, whichever one you like, after you apply your makeup. Tarte Mask here. This is the Double Detox Amazonian Clay Exfoliating Facial Mask. And yeah, it's just a, it kind of has little granules in it to help exfoliate while you're applying it. And then it's just a regular clay mask that detox pores and just cleans out all that junk from your face. Tarte is, uh, again, doesn't use synthetic anything, mineral oil, parabens, um, it's gluten free, which is really important if you have an allergy to that. And again, is cruelty free, so great brand. Okay, so this is the setting spray that I was talking about. It's the one that you use after you put on your makeup. And this is the D-Slick. I guess you could use this before too. It just helps control oil. Um, and I don't like to be oily in my T-zone. So I use this, oil-free, paraben-free. But this is another perk that I got. And this is the One Step Wonders Basha. Um, these are just the masks. So it comes with the Luminizing Black Mask, which there's a picture on my Instagram of me applying that. And it's just this gel-like, shiny sheet mask. Um, so that helps with pores, detoxing and illuminizing. And there's a brightening white mask. And then it comes with a, a beauty oil. So I guess you apply that after. Makeup wipes. The Ole Hendrickson Truth To Go Wipes. These are gentle, moisturizing, age-defying cleansing wipes. Helps get, you know, makeup, dirt, and oil off your face. I use these a lot when I travel. It's just super convenient. And they smell like citrusly goodness. When I'm on the road, I just like to kind of take 
extra care of my skin because it gets thrashed from the nasty airplane air and just the different climates. Carez Hand Lotion. This is the extra moisturizing cream for dry skin. Uh, Carez is another really good brand without any nasties in it. This just smells so clean and fresh and good. Okay, I wanted to try a to-go uh, travel pack of chi oh. Okay, and I got two conditioners. I thought I was getting a shampoo and a conditioner. Womp womp, but I got conditioner. So, there you go. I have two of them now. Oh, I don't even know. Leah Giorno? 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 Hydrating, Hydrarish conditioner for all hair types. I really just liked the containers. Eco pouch leaves your you with more product and the planet with less waste. Uh, Caudalie. Beauty Elixir, this is basically just like a smoothing and glowing spritz that you put on your face to rehydrate it. You can set makeup with it. I use it on airplanes. Um, I'll spray it on my face and then I'll just kind of spray it on my hands and breathe it in and it's just really relaxing and it kind of calms you down because it has that menthol minty kind of uh, smell to it. Uh, a lipstick. I have the Rouge Volupt Shine in number one and I'm wearing the um, I think it's number 15. It's the, the one that's special to Sephora. It's the raspberry one, but it's the same Rouge Bluff Shine. So this is number one. This is more of a fall color, kind of a burgundy color. This was another little throw in. Uh, this is the Bamboo Beach Mango Coconut Refreshing Dry Shampoo. So it's different than the, the other sh dry shampoo that I got, the translucent kind of spray. Uh, this is actually called a dry shampoo, but it's made by the same Alterna and it's just like a little shaker. This would be really good for travel because it's teeny tiny. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know uh, what your favorite items are from Sephora and uh, I'll let you know maybe down the road on some of my favorites from this collection of stuff that I got. So hope you're enjoying your day and I'll see you in my next video.